Praise God, everybody. Great to connect with you today. We have had questions that have come to our attention that people have asked and needing answers. So we want to do our best every week to try to answer these questions as accurately as we can. One of the questions that came to us was this, does God ever change his mind? Well, we discover in Genesis chapter 6 and verse 5 and 6 that the wickedness of man came up before God. And in verse uh, 6 of Genesis 6, the Bible says it repented the Lord that he had even made man. The word repent there means to change your mind. That means that man's wickedness was so incredible, God changed his mind in that moment and thought, should I really have created man? We know that God made a covenant with Noah, and Noah was a man that, that God honored and had favor. But we see that God has the ability to change his mind. We also discover in the book of Jonah that God sent Jonah to Nineveh. Now, this is all that God told Jonah. Jonah, go to Nineveh and tell the people there that their wickedness has come up before me and is great. And Jonah bucked God and he flew uh, down to buy a ticket uh, on a boat and he, and he moved away from uh, Nineveh to go to Tarshish. To make a long story short, we know that he was swallowed by a whale. The whale uh, vomited him up on the beach at Nineveh. When Jonah went and told the people of Nineveh that their wickedness had come up before God and that God was going to destroy them, they repented and fasted before God. And God saw that and was moved with compassion and mercy. And Jonah got mad at God. He said, God, I knew that if these people repented that you would change your mind and not destroy them. So God had intended wickedness to come to Nineveh, but because the people repented and asked God to forgive them, then God changed his mind. So we know that God is able to do that. Also in the Psalms, it says that his mercy is from everlasting to everlasting. In other words, God never refuses an opportunity to show mercy where judgment may have come because of man's response. In Psalms 136, 26 times David wrote and said, his mercy is from everlasting to everlasting. The word mercy means compassion or favor. There are times that God changes his mind. And if you're headed for judgment and you don't know Jesus, if you'll repent of your sins, then that judgment will be turned to mercy because Jesus dealt with your judgment on Calvary. I hope that answers that question. I hope you're blessed today because that's what we call it.